the tears are rolling down like a river to the ocean and there's no one else around you won't question my devotion What makes a person a hero? Well, right now, several of us would say there are doctors, our nurses, our firemen, police officers protecting us so we stay safe. But I also want to give recognition to our everyday heroes, the people that are taking their talents to another level. Downtown Las Vegas is my home. And unfortunately, with what's happened, a lot of these businesses have been boarded up. But what the local artists have done in this community, it's brightened it up. When your heart can use a break, and it's too broken to reopen, I'll be patient, I will wait until you're ready to be open. So for me, looking around and seeing that a lot of these buildings have the words, you know, hope, or they, they see the way that they view what's happening right now. And I happen to come here at the right time, maybe it's fate, but I got to meet a lot of these local artists to bring positivity and joy. It can be through art, and art is healing. And they depicted that right here in downtown Las Vegas. So tell me what you have going on here. So I'm just starting uh, this mural here. Um, I've done about five already in Fremont East or on the, in the Arts District on Main Street. And when I'm finished, I'll probably do about 10 or 12 different murals. And basically we're just beautifying the boarded up buildings. When you see that these buildings now have some art and color, I think it just makes you happy looking at it. Yeah, and it's almost become a thing now and they're calling it the Main Street Boardwalk and stuff. And I know we have to keep social distancing and stuff, but there's no reason you can't go for a walk or ride your bike down the street and check out all the amazing art. That's really what this is all about. We all have to take care of each other, however we do that. This is our neighborhood, this is the arts district. It's like a family for a lot of us out here. We want to stay home as much as we can, but sometimes we have to get out to get those essential items. It's nice to know that businesses downtown, like Rebar, have adapted their practices to make it safe for you and I to leave our homes. You can place your orders online and pick up your items Thursday through Saturday from 2 to 7. They practice safety first there, so they'll have masks and gloves, and you might as well grab a drink while you're at it. you do to me? You said that it would last, but how come it's the last time? We got together some local artists in our community. Um, because of this, it allowed us to get a grant started. So it's helping local businesses and artists. And uh, now you see all these businesses with beautiful art. Um, you see artists painting live. And so this is what's going on. And now we are starting a drive through business. So you can drive through. Uh, it's called Boardwalk Liquors. Dot com and you can drive through and pick up your orders and it's you know it's for our community it's to help raise money for our bartenders uh, our local businesses and our artists um, so that's pretty much what we're working on at this time is this the last time that I lay my eyes upon you is this the last time that I ever watch you leave this is the last thing I would ever have done to you this is the last thing that I thought you'd do to me we said that
if you're out and about. Take a cruise down Main Street to check out all the wonderful pieces of art. And if you place an order online at BoardWalkLiquors.com, you can pick it up right over there. Stay safe, Nevada. I'm Samantha. You can call me Sam with Spirit of Nevada. Brought to you by the Richard Harris Law Firm. I'm trying to hold your hand, but feeling like my hand's tight. Hey, that's a wrap! Okay, ready? I'm like Chung Lee from Street Fighter. Boom! Yes! Okay, you got that? <laughs> Just okay.